At the end of Ahsoka Episode 6, Thrawn, who had recently learned of the forthcoming arrival of Ahsoka Tano to Paradia, asked Morgan Elspeth for some simple information about her, such as her background, her history, her homeworld, and her master. Reasonable stuff. However, this potentially raises a bit of a logical issue, as shouldn't he already at least know who her master was? Because here's the thing, Thrawn knew Anakin Skywalker back during the Clone Wars, and also worked alongside Darth Vader after the rise of the Empire. Heck, he was even one of the few people who had deduced that Vader and Skywalker were the same person. As seen during the novel Thrawn Alliances, Vader and Thrawn were dispatched by the Emperor to deal with an issue involving the Chiss Ascendancy, and Thrawn, being the smart cookie that he is, put two and two together and figured it all out. But he decided to keep the secret to himself. You see, Thrawn is usually the best informed person in any situation, so it's natural to assume that he'd do some background research on Anakin and Vader while working alongside them, meaning that eventually he'd come across some info about Skywalker's Padawan. Maybe Thrawn has all this knowledge himself already and is merely playing it close to the vest in terms of information when he asks Morgan Elspeth about her. Who really knows at this point? Dude's over there playing 4D chess. 